Nigerians on social media have called on the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission to investigate the Oba of Lagos real one Akiolu for money laundering. The monarch had said two million US dollars and 17 million naira were stolen when youths attacked his palace on October 21st, 2020, in the violence that erupted after the NTAS protests. Oba Akiolu, whose staff of office known as the Okba Ashe was also taken away by hoodlums who broke into his palace during the riot spoke on Wednesday in Lagos. He said, I will support anything that will move Lagos forward. I have appealed to the federal government to assist Lagos with what we have suffered. The incident that happened here from October 20th to 23rd is so saddening. The destruction we suffered in Lagos is so enormous that in any other part of the country, Many buildings were burnt, including vehicles used to generate income. I can now say publicly that they stole two million US dollars and seventeen million naira from my palace. Those who committed the offense would not have done that if they knew the implication. But as a father, I won't place any cost on them. Many social medias have since accused the monarch of money laundry, saying a private citizen should not have at home the amount of money reportedly stolen. A tweet at Uncle Ajala wrote, The Oba of Lagos says that $2 million and $17 million were stolen when hoodlums attacked his palace during the last NTAS protest. He should be telling EFCC what he was doing with that amount and how he got the $2 million after his revelation. But how would the Oba of Lagos have $20 million in his house to imagine that he just discovered that after many months, EFCC, where are you? Is Oba of Lagos operating a BDC bureau the change in his palace? Is this not something violation? Is this not money laundering at official AFCC? Integrity 56 asked.